Baby Show us your baby Jake yeah. teddy bear. There it is, look. Baby Jake not the being a swing. <laughs> baby Jake love to do is sing. There he is. Where did you get that one from? Is baby it Jake Vintage, not the is it an official? Yeah. Baby Jake not to do is thing. Can I see it? Can we see him? Show me him. Let me have a look. Magic. It's a bit baby. creepy looking, look. When you take the hood down. Yeah. Oh, yeah, it looks like an old man. <laughs> there he is. You got two of them, though, didn't you? Yeah. Do you have one in a different costume? To be fair, I thought it was going to be like this big. So would you say that, that actually that's something we haven't talked about, the Vinted app, which you've been using a lot of to get a lot of things for him for Crimbo. Mm -hmm. Stuff that you can't buy in the shop anymore, but that he likes like to do is the Toy Story stuff and you know, certain yeah, things. I could buy new for like triple the price. Yeah. Because of how rough he is playing with some of his stuff. I've got it like, as new or, you know, for a lot cheaper. Um, but yeah, that app is so good. She's even got him one thing for Crimble, which we can say because he won't really understand it. The weightlifting man from Toy Story 1. And the only, the, I think that's the only one which been a bit annoying she paid the woman how much for it was it 16 pounds? Pounds. and he came and one of the weights in the photograph that she put wasn't in it and she said she'd put it in it yeah, she me a liar. so that kind of sucks a little bit but it's still got one weight and because it's not coming out of a packet with two and him losing it he'll be fine with that because he won't know he'll only ever have one so i think he'll be fine if it had two and we lost one then he'd be kicking off oh, you know i said i wanted to get him a stinky pete yeah there was somebody selling just Stinky Pete without his hat on Vinted for 70 quid. And it had like 30, fa 30 people favourited it. That's why I'm going to get him that set on Smith's because it comes with the whole set for like 30 quid, including Stinky Pete with his hat. Mm. If you haven't used the Vinted app, Amy would highly recommend it. I don't use it. I don't know how to use it, but Amy knows how to use it. Use it. So you buy direct from a person... But then it goes Daddy. through them, the money. Daddy. Vinted, not them, Daddy. per se. Or... Yeah, and the good thing right. is is that it's not like bidding wars, so they set a price. Daddy. You can make an offer for a cheaper. And if there's one seller that is selling loads of things that you like, then you can do bundles, and then you get a discount on the bundles. It's, it's, it is a good app. I much prefer it to eBay. To being a swing. Baby Jay loves to do his thing. Well done. <laughs> baby, baby, baby Jay. Baby Jay not to be a swing. Baby Jay loves to do to do his thing. Show me on your tablet. Mummy. Show me. Show me. He's going to find it. <laughs> space. He's in space. Show me. Show me. Sunflower is yummy. It's the sunflower sun. sun. Daddy. It's sunflowers. Yeah. Not so close. You can't see it if we do that. It's a baby Jake. Baby Jake. Baby Jake. Not the being a swing. Baby Jay, love to do is sing. <laughs> Baby Jay, love to bring a swing. Baby Jay, love to do is sing. How long have you been doing that do for? Is sing. Has he been doing it all day? Magic. Yeah. Bay. On and off. What happened yesterday, Mia? <laughs> you tried to through the TV. If you couldn't hear that, 
Jules had a bit of an episode last night when I went to work. Where bedtime, he didn't really accept bedtime. Is that basically just he didn't really accept bedtime? No, it's because he wanted to go on YouTube. I wanted to go on YouTube, but it was bedtime. Coming up to, I put him to bed early in the end. And I've got a call from Amy because she needed to remove the 50 inch TV and put the old one back in. Which now looks like it's a minuscule. You can attach Chico, a picture of Chico, the one that he damaged. Yeah, we'll put that Chico, in now. Chico. But yeah, we did have that 32 inch TV spare from when we were gifted that big 50 inch TV. So hence why it didn't have a screen protection because the one we had was for this 32 inch which he broke. Didn't he? So we're now back to a little TV. It's not and the end of the world. On that one or the one before? On that one. That he broke. Yeah, he broke the screen protector. <laughs> then when we were gifted the big one, we put the big one up and put that 32-inch one away. So... And, to be fair, we didn't get a screen protector for the big one because we said... Oh, it was it a cost. Last, it won't last us a week. And um, we had it for two years. And not only that, the screen protection was nearly the cost of buying like a new TV or a second hand TV, so it seemed a bit crazy to spend, you know, 60 quid on a screen protector on a TV that was given to us. Um, not that we weren't grateful, but we didn't pay for the TV and it would have cost us 60 or 70 quid, I think, for that size TV, um, which seemed a bit mad. Um, Considering he broke the previous screen protector as well, we didn't really see much point, but... Daddy? So, yeah. Daddy? You got the Chewy. Chewy. Um, we sort it out, don't we? You always do. Yeah, it's just one of those things. We have been two years, though, so... Not the end of the world, actually. It just sucks the time of year that he's done it, that's all. Yeah. But yeah, so... It's been a bit of a twitchy couple of weeks because George went back a week and a half ago and he went back on the Wednesday. The Thursday, they cancelled his school. The Friday, he was back in. And then that whole weekend, he was a nightmare because... Oi! My shoe! Stop shouting! What's my shoe? He's upstairs. He's in his bedroom. George wants to tease him with that chewy because Matthew's been using that chewy. So George is only asking where Matthew is because he wants to tease him with it, look. Isn't he? Yeah. The only reason why he's shouting for him, but better the chewy than cloves or something else. George doesn't normally go for it. I think he's just doing it literally to tease Matty. Mummy, yeah. <laughs> yeah, George, you're hilarious. But yeah, so it's, it's been a tricky couple of weeks, isn't it, really? Yeah. But hopefully. This week will be a bit better because he's back to a full week like he was last week, but I think he got better as the week went on last week. We did get a conversation in the school that he put some holes in the classroom wall as well. I don't know if that's kicking or hitting, but they did say that they've reduced his his um, sort of free play time. He's been more on a timetable doing work, which he's not been too happy about apparently. But he got better as the week went on, I think. And, you know, apart from that yesterday, he's been okay. Yeah. Careful. Go careful with it. Yes. Bye bye, um, everyone. Um, Amy's been doing lots of crimbo shopping, which we can't really discuss because obviously the boys watch the videos, but she's done quite a bit of that. Um, anything else happened? Oh yeah, there was one other thing. Amy has been selected to be a school parent governor at George's school. Um, they haven't said to not say anything, have they? I mean, they've got to announce it anyway, so I don't suppose it really matters if we say. Um, she put her name down and we didn't think we were going to hear anything because we hadn't heard nothing. And yesterday at the blue, we had an email saying she, her and someone else have been selected and she's got a first meeting on Thursday. 
So basically, that's like a liaison between the school and parents who take forward issues from what we gather. Yeah. And sort of make the school accountable for certain things. So you get to see the finance side of things, where the money's going in the school and all that sort of thing. So you can ask questions sort of on behalf of the parents and stuff like that and stuff. So that's good. It means rather than, like, a lot of people will just moan about everything, we're doing something positive to try to help the school and help the students and whatever. Yeah, I hope so. That's why I, that's why I applied for it, because I, I wanted to be able to have some sort of, hopefully, positive impact. And rather than, most people will just sit there and complain about the school not doing this, the school not doing that, and, you know, bitch and whine about it in the playground, for example, Daddy rather than actually doing anything constructive to try to resolve issues that they may come across but so i'm sure amy will be fantastic at that because she's a very patient person um you've got to have with kids like this boy but yeah so well done me Baby Jake, yeah. No, baby Jake, that's a big nice swing. Baby Jake. So, yeah, it's Sunday. I'm working later. Um, so, we got to do the bath today and stuff like that, which is always fun. <laughs> um, that's magic. I suppose we better try to get that bag out somewhere for a quick walk, I suppose. Unless you wanted to get out for a breath of fresh air for half hour. Yeah. I feel, I think, I don't know whether it was because of the heavy sobbing that I did last night, but I've just got a headache, I just feel so tired today. I'm taking Paris Fatmas, going to have a nap for an hour. But yeah, so that's, that's kind of what's been happening, not a lot apart from, you know, we don't like just making videos on negative stuff, but it's been a bit of a tricky couple of weeks. Um, well, it's all part and parcel. I'm gonna have to just get through it, same as everyone else. But yeah, we're back on there. Tiny, <laughs> what well, looks tiny. 32 inch TV on that ginormous unit. It kind of looks a bit out of place, but we'll sort something out. Yeah, we'll sort it out. <laughs>